Well, hello there, everyone. It's Blake, and I am back with a very special guest who you guys probably haven't seen in a long time. I've actually gotten a couple comments asking where she's been. Where have you been, Sam? I've been around. Busy. She's been around and busy. So, anyways, <laughs> she's back for a very exciting video. Are you stoked? I'm very stoked. What are we doing today? Popping cooking. Popping cooking. This is something that I've been obsessed with ever since I saw it on YouTube a couple years ago, actually. And I found some at this local. I guess it's like an ethnic Asian store. It sells like mostly Chinese stuff, but these are Jap these are Japanese. <laughs> but these are Japanese. So um, yes, I found some of these. There's a whole bunch of different ones that I got, but today we are doing the sushi one. So that's what it looks like if I can pick it up and focus there. I have all the uh, directions here on my laptop because nothing on this box is in English. The only thing that's in English is pop and cooking. I don't even know if that's in English. Is that English? Yeah, I think so. I think pop so. and cooking. So <laughs> hopefully, if not, I can definitely read Japanese, which is really cool. Yes, yeah, so this is the back of the box though. So as you can tell, I can't read any of this. <laughs> I wish I could. That'd be very cool. But yes, we have the English translation on my laptop here so we can look at that and go along. Are you excited? I'm so excited. Me too. I love this. It's so cool. So I've seen a couple videos of people doing this one, specifically the sushi one on YouTube. So that's going to be exciting to do. Oh, this is what the package looks like. That's really neat. See, we have to cut like around the edge there. So, mm -hmm. Off to a good start. I don't think it makes a difference. It does, because you have to like lay it out flat so you can push stuff against it. You can have that. Thank you. Okay, so I just did that. Isn't that fun? Wow! And this is the contents inside. So this is what we have. We have a little squeezy thingy. A bunch of ingredient packets that are literally just sugar. These are all the ingredient packets. Hopefully you guys can pick that up on camera. I'm not sure if you can see. Anyways, yeah, ooh, I have a cup of water here so that we can mix all this stuff here in this tray. So let's go now and figure out what the first step is to do. It says, let's make sushi rice. Okay, so the first step is to take the blue packet, which I guess this is the rice, and you squeeze this thingy full of water and fill it up in that one right here, that little oval thingy. Oh my gosh, it smells like grapes. This is gonna be delicious. Mm, I'm it's excited. Okay. Terrible for so you. just pour that all in there and now mix it up with the little spatula. Smoky. <gasps> it smells like my childhood. I don't know. I can't. Oh, it smells like your childhood. Okay. Bubble gum, maybe? Of oh, it smells like that toothpaste. Yeah, okay. Oh my gosh, that like about. kids toothpaste that had like the red and white yeah. and the like, clear thingy in yeah, it or something, or red and green. Too, yeah, I, oh my gosh, that's what it smells like. So cool. If you guys have no idea what we're talking about, sorry, but if you remember that like it was in that tube and had dinosaurs all over the package. Yeah. Yes. Oh. oh my gosh. And you like squeezed out the tube and it was like red and green and clear or red and green and white or something. So, oh my gosh, crazy. This doesn't look very ricey. You have to like squish it. Like. This is so rice-like. It's, it's like sticky rice. <laughs> okay, well that's good for now then. There's just that huge blob of rice-like <laughs> toothpaste mixture. <laughs> Step two. Okay, so the next one we're doing is the egg stuff. It says to fill up to the inside of the swirly line. That one to the top of the fill line, it says. I don't know what that means, but. There's a fill line there. Oh, that's what it means then. Mmm, <laughs> nice and yellow. <gasps> oh, it smells so weird. <laughs> Make it Oopsie. a mess, the egg. The eggs don't want to be like this. They want to be born into chicks. This is like jello. Oh my gosh, it's like getting thick. That is so intense. Oof, it smells like those jelly straws. That's what that one looks like. Okay, now step three is to make tuna. So again, same thing as the last one. We take the little water droplet -y thingy, fill it up to the fill line. <laughs> Just go with scissors. <laughs> Yum. Mix, mix, mix. Mm. I love candy sushi so much. I haven't even tried it yet. It's true, I haven't, I haven't <laughs> tried it before, but it looks good, so I know I'll like it, I think, hopefully. What if we don't like it? That'll be sad. Well, then we won't eat it. <laughs> okay. So yeah, it's like the same one. You just want to make it flat and level on the top so that you can get perfect tuna shapes. <laughs> <laughs> I guess. I'm assuming. I don't know. Okay, now the next step is to make the seaweed. So I'm going to take this, it's like gum. It's this little black packet here. Cut it open. And then on this, this is like the actual package of it. You like take it and stretch it and mold it to fit right there on that little rectangle thingy at the bottom, which is super cool. So. Let's see if this will work out. Okay, so it says push down with your finger and then Don't pull, apart. pull. Put it onto here. Yay! I did it. There's our seaweed. That's exciting. It looks so cute. Okay, so the next step that we're doing is to make the salmon roe, which is super cool. It's like my favorite part. I watch videos on YouTube and how amazing does it look? Pretty cool. Pretty cool, you guys. Heard it straight from Sam's <laughs> mouth. 
sorry. Yes, she's dying. Can't get through a video without dying. Apparently. Have you been dying for these past months that I haven't seen you? Pretty much. It's always a good thing. Okay, so now those are filled up. So <laughs> we're taking the green packet, putting it in section A. I got a little bit in our tuna. Hopefully it doesn't make anything happen weird there. And this is literally, it looks like nothing. So we're just gonna mix this one up. And now we are taking section B packet and we're gonna put it into that little thingy of water. And then we're gonna mix all this stuff. Okay, so now it says to take the water droplet. I'll do an example first. And take up a whole bunch of the gelatin stuff, I guess. And you want to take it from three centimeters high. I have no idea how high that is. Is that like an inch or something? Like that? I don't know. I'll just <laughs> drop it from like up here into section A one by one. Mm. Oh my goodness though, what the heck? I don't even get it. Like what is that? Oh my gosh, I wonder what like scientific formula is behind this <laughs> that makes it go like and do that. You wanna try it? Sure. Eva, so gently. Please drop it into section A. If you squeeze it really hard. That is really strange, you guys. I want to show you what it looks like after because it's so weird. Can I do more? Yeah. Okay, so I'll show you guys what they look like if you can see. I'm not sure. We took section B, dropped it into section A, and it made a whole bunch of these funky little eggs. They look like that, if you can see that. Oh my gosh. It's weird because it actually looks like fish eggs. Yeah. And I don't like fish eggs. Like that's something that I really don't like about sushi because I don't really like fish that much. I don't know, it'll be interesting to see what it, the texture is and everything on that. I'm scared for that. Mm -hmm. Okay, the last step we're doing in this step thingy is making soy sauce. And there wasn't actually a section for this on the instructions, so I'm not sure if I like missed that part. So you want to fill it up to that line in there and then add the brown packet and it makes soy sauce apparently. You, you just got soy it soy in the fish eggs. Soy sauce eggs. Okay, so the next step to do is to cut up your eggs and tuna. Oh my gosh, so freaky. I have a plate for us to do all of our like presenting presentation stuff on, so it's gonna be really fun. There's one tuna. Oh my god, oh, so, so cool. Tuna y? I don't eat tuna. My mom loves the tuna in sushi. I don't eat I don't like raw, raw fish. Sushi. I would never eat raw fish. Oh, it's sick. Sushi. We're having sushi. And they like real sushi. This is real sushi. Right. Surprise, it's real yeah. sushi. Could you imagine if it actually tasted like real sushi? That would That'd be frightening. Be gross, though, yeah, I wouldn't yeah. want to do that. <laughs> so there's our tuna and our egg. Missed a step there. We're supposed to form sushi rice. <laughs> I guess so we take one of these thingies, put it into here. Way too much. That's it. That little amount for that huge amount of tuna and egg. We each get to make one. Oh, okay. Okay, so you take that thingy and just like stick it in there, I guess. They're not going into like little blocks though, mm -hmm. so I have no idea. Have you seen that, that cube thing that makes rice into cubes? <laughs> no, I haven't. <laughs> it's so cool, it's like a little box, so you fill it with rice, so you just push it all together and it makes a little cube of rice. Sounds really interesting. <laughs> Okay. I thought it was. So those are your those are your things? I guess. That's what we did. Okay. So now we take a tuna and place it on top of there. And then take an egg, place it on there. Your turn. It's not even sticking on top. Okay, now the next one is to make the Iruka no Gunamaki. No idea what that Rock is. That. Yes, I did. So form sushi rice into that little thingy. Good. And then you take your seaweed and you wrap it around your rice. Oh my gosh. That is the tiniest sushi roll I've ever seen. That is so cute though. Like, look at that though. For real. So cute. Okay, now just plop it down in there. And we're gonna take some of our fish eggs. This is top with salmon roe. So I guess just scoop right in there. Oh my gosh. And then you top it all over. Ah, that is so weird. Mm, it's so cute. It looks like real. I mean, aside from the fact that it's candy. Well, the fish eggs look real. Yeah, it's the fish seaweed. eggs. That's scary. I don't like it. I mean, I like it, but <laughs> it's so freaky and real looking that it is kind of off-putting. Oh my gosh, this just reminds me of Finding Nemo. Remember the beginning of Finding Nemo when Nemo's all his brothers and sisters and stuff get taken away by the Barracuda? Ooh, bad, bad memories. Awful. Don't talk about that. Okay, I'll try my best not to talk about that. There's four little plates or whatever. Okay, now the next one we're gonna make is Chira Shiz... Chira... Chira Shizushi, <laughs> I think. I... Sorry. <laughs> I pronounced that wrong. I have no idea what that says. Um, so apparently you just like squish up a bunch of the tuna, squish up a bunch of the egg, take a rice... Sushi rice. <laughs> Take the tuna, and we are placing it on top of the chira shizushi. That's what it's called, right? Yeah. And now we are taking the egg and putting that on top of the... <laughs> did you just I spill... Did. I got... I wanted salmon roe on top of yours. I'm sorry. We can move it. I wanted you to have wet rice. Hmm? <laughs> 
Thanks. Oh my gosh, there's Nemo's everywhere. Okay, so we have that, and now we take some, it doesn't say to put any egg on it, but I want to do that anyways. There's the Chiris Suzuki, or whatever it's called. <laughs> Honestly, I have no idea how to pronounce that. Okay, so. You're gonna eat it now? I guess that's it. I want some soy sauce on mine though. I want to try like, what the soy sauce is like. Oh my god, there's an egg in it. <laughs> okay, so I'll try and show you guys to the best of my ability all of our sushis. Ah. So there's my two, and then that's our Chiro Shizushi, or whatever it's mm -hmm. called. There's Sam's, and then there's our little cute one. So let's try the tuna one first, okay? okay. I'm so scared. Ready? Oh, you're going for oh. it already. Oh my gosh, the texture. <laughs> it's so weird. It doesn't taste bad, but it's mm -mm. so weird. It tastes good. Okay, now I'll try the egg one. I'm gonna try some soy sauce. Well, I already have soy sauce on mine. You do, you're good. Oh, you didn't dunk it in? I like the first one better. I'm not sure what the difference is. It doesn't taste that different, but. How are we gonna do this? For some reason. I'll take a bite and you can have the rest. Okay. okay. Oh my god. It's okay. <laughs> eggs everywhere. Oh my god, the eggs though. They're dressed like real eggs. Mmm. Oh. Mmm. <laughs> what? Like pop? Yeah. It's like chewing gum though. The, the seaweed is like gum. So strange. Do you want to try the Chira sh Shizushi? Sure. I can't get over the eggs though, like, I've never had the real eggs before, I don't think, but I know what they're like, like the real fish eggs. These are just like them. Wow, that was very interesting, did you love it? Yeah. It was really strange. I've never done the sushi one before, I did make the donut one before, but that was interesting to try the sushi one. It's a lot different than the donut one, so that was fun. So if you guys don't know what they are, they are pop and cook, and you can buy them on like Amazon, or there's like an actual website that sells a whole bunch of different Asian products like this, so that's super cool. I bought these at a place called TNT Supermarket, if you guys live in Canada, I think those are kind of like everywhere around Canada, I'm not sure if they're in the States. Who knows, but yes, these are like four or five bucks or whatever at TNT Supermarket, so very, very fun. It's entertaining to do, I guess. It's interesting to try a new experience like that, so it was very exciting. Hopefully you guys enjoyed watching as much as we enjoyed making and trying the foods. It was delicious. Yeah. Almost as good as real sushi. I like real sushi better though, mm -hmm. but it's still really, really cute and fun, so. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that. Thank you so much for watching. You can follow me here on Twitter and all my other social media links will be down in the more info box below. Make sure you subscribe for more exciting videos and I will see you guys all real soon. Bye. bye. <laughs> you don't get to say bye with me. Oh, root. That was interesting. <laughs>